The Women in Cinema Collective (WCC) has questioned whether it was enough to punish Malayalam actor Srinath Bhasi alone for verbally abusing a female anchor even as it welcomed the disciplinary proceedings against him. The Kerala Film Producers Association's decision to impose a temporary ban on the actor was praised by the WCC in a social media post but cited prior examples in which some other movie business personnel who had committed crimes more grave than those committed by Srinath Bhasi went unpunished. There are many police and court cases involving men from the film industry and some are facing trial for sexual crimes. The Kerala Film Producers Association has disciplined Srinath Bhasi for insulting a female journalist. This action undoubtedly helps in understanding the significance of respect we should show towards our colleagues. However, we also have to consider why such prompt disciplinary action is only accorded to this incident alone. The WCC members also stated that Liju Krishna, the director of Nivin Poli starring film Padavetta, who was arrested, is currently free on bail. Meanwhile, there have been allegations against the executive producer of the film. The film's producers are celebrating the upcoming release of this film directed by the accused. They added that Vijay Babu, who was released on bail after being arrested in connection with a sexual assault case, is lauded by fellow professionals and permitted to carry on with his life as if nothing bad had happened. They questioned, is it true that money and power will always determine who should be and who should not be disciplined in this industry? Why are the Kerala Film Producers Association not taking any action against these individuals and their companies? News Desk, Comedy Global.